what's up everybody. I don't know if we can hear me, I got the AC on. Uh, yeah, it's, it's pretty hot, I'm on my way uh, to go grab some food right now. It's actually gonna be a pretty long trip. Look what happened to the car. Taste this bomb food I've been waiting, I've been craving for a minute right now. The shrimps and the crawdads. Good. Try to take a little trip to go get it. Uh, Zam got this around my hometown, but. I only had it's probably like my second time I ate there too. First time I ate there, it had me hooked just like that. I think the first time I had went, it's called a uh, like damn, where's my phone? Oh, my phone right there. It's like cat, it's like uh, catfish or craw crawdads fish. My bad, I forgot the name, but. Yeah, food is fire. I'll put some more a little bit of seasoning in there. Up. 
I wish you guys could smell this. It smells fire. It smells real fire. Yeah, shrimp. Oh, snap. Shit, all this stuff. Good. show y'all um this basketball game I had played like a couple of, a couple of days ago but uh instead of me um showing y'all the game I'll just explain it because footage on there wasn't that great where I had the camera at during the basketball game so but I wasn't meant on having a basketball game that day it just some people that came to the park, we started shooting hoops and stuff like that. So it just happened organically. But uh, we were, uh, I was just shooting around and stuff, you know. Mm. You know, just, uh, just shooting around trying to get some exercise, burn out some energy and stuff like that. And, uh, so like, I'll probably say like, I don't know, maybe 15 minutes later, there was some, uh, some women came by, started shooting some hoops. They were older too. You know, maybe it wasn't like around my age, you know, I'm 26, so they're a lot older than me. I mean, a lot older, like, you know, maybe late 50s and stuff like that so it was just like a cool little 21 game but uh see i was trying to play you know good what i mean by good like i wasn't trying to go too too bad on them you know what i mean but still i wanted to like burn my burn my energy and it turned out i had burned a lot more energy before the game had started I was so dehydrated before I say like, I don't know, maybe like 10 points in the game, maybe, I, I don't even say even 10, like maybe like six points in the game, I was already dehydrated. I was burning out. I mean, I was out there dying because right now, the weather out here gets like 101, 102, 105s. And it's not like uh, it's not like straight heat. Like from the sun, it's humid heat. So it could be like it could look like cloudy, but not. You know, there's clouds out there. It's just still really hot. Like it's burning up. Mm. Trims this fire. The crowd out is really good too. But, um, anyway, so I was saying, um, so I had to, like, literally stop in the middle of the game just to, like, get some water and stuff like that. And then, uh, once I had cooled down and everything, like I said, it gets a little hot and humid, came back in with some more energy and stuff like that. And then on, on accident, mistakenly, you know, like I said, it was only 20, it was only three of us. So it was me, two other gentlemen, and then, you know, I had the, the highest point at that moment, and uh, he's trying to guard the other older gentleman, right? And out of nowhere, when he was coming towards me, I was trying to come uh, come up for the ball, and he just runs right into me. And I stood there like a brick wall. I mean, like, like on some NBA stuff, he just collapsed and fell. Like, he bounced off me and fell to the floor. And I was just like, oh, man. I felt so bad. Like, I, I really felt really bad because, like, you know, they're older. And I'm playing with, you know what I mean? So, I didn't mean to, like, you know, post up that strong. Because at first, you know, I was moving real fast. You know what I'm saying? I'm doing my thing. I'm going in between them. 
with the basketball, making my layups and everything like that. And uh, it was just that one, that one time, it was just, just the way that he just like fell to the ground. It was like, oh man. It was like that moment when everyone just stopped and looks. It's like, damn. Like one of those, oh, like, it was that bad. But other than that, you know, I, I started to chill, chill some more. And, uh, yeah, I ended up losing the game just because, like, I, lo I lost for, like, three points because I just was dehydrated at the same time. But I still kept the game going, you know what I mean? I wasn't like, oh, I'm not really going to try anymore type stuff. But it was just... It was a cool, fun game. It wasn't on some win or lose or shit, or it wasn't like betting or anything like that. It was just a, it was just a cool game. But I wish I had better footage for y'all to see it. It was just wasn't enough. It wasn't the best content for me. You know what I mean? Like I said, I wanted to give y'all some better content. So, better than that. Then it was like another two on two game that day too. It was pretty chill. Uh, uh, another person that came that was probably like around my age, and we was just like I said, uh, we happened to be on his team. Actually, he had came in the first game later on. Like he had just jumped in the game because he had just shoved at the park, and then it just happened to be another. Like the game ended with all uh, with four people. It started off with just three people and then it ended with four people. But, uh, yeah, it was a cool game. But, yeah. <clears throat> like, this was fire. My way spicy. That's nice. Uh, the season on here is pretty good. I think that's why I like the seafood the best. Just because the seafood's good. But, uh, yeah, I'm just going to give you guys some, like, you know, little catch-up stories. Oh, shit. Spilling it on myself. Because I know you guys probably aren't familiar with me yet. Or if you guys are new to the channel and stuff like that, you guys probably aren't familiar with me. You know what I mean? So I'll give you guys a little backstories and stuff I done, you know. Uh, I guess this past day or stuff like that. Or just even... What you gonna be looking on for this channel? You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna be doing vlogs like this. I'm gonna try to do, make it more consistent and show you guys stuff like if I'm in the studio and stuff like that. I would you guys show you more stuff? If I already haven't, if you guys see me on Snapchat, I showed stuff for me in the studio, but I haven't brought that to my channel. You know, the last thing that had happened uh, before I was able to, you guys, you know, show you some more. More of that stuff, in other words, uh, someone had actually came to the house and stole my studio equipment out the car. So, you know what I mean? If y'all saw that on Snap, I was pretty hot about that. You feel me? Because normally, around this neighborhood, stuff like that don't really go down like that. So, it was pretty shocking, but, you know, things happen. So, I'm just going to end up probably either showing you guys a newer studio or me going to a, a studio because I've been to a couple uh, out in LA where I'm at in Central Valley so it's probably like a three hour three hour drive and stuff like that so I've been to like one studio out there but it wasn't for me uh, that studio session I was actually out there for it was like a taquitos commercial I wasn't in the, the commercial for the taquitos, but I was there like behind the scenes and stuff like that for this commercial. And um, one of the actresses off the TV show at that time with Kevin Hart, oh uh, man, my bad if I had bad memory, but um, one of the actresses, one of the female actresses that was on the TV show with Kevin Hart, she was doing the taquitos commercial and I had someone I was with that was doing the commercial and so she was there and you know, we had conversated and stuff like that so it was pretty cool you know to be you know behind the scenes back there and watch someone work and do do stuff like that but um other than that like i said you know i'm gonna be 
an overview on a couple of little fun things that I've been doing around and what I've been around and stuff like that to you guys. But, uh, yeah, this food is fire. I'm almost done. You can see this lot of sauce and shrimp in here still, so. But, uh, yeah, so like I said, um, I go by the name of Jada from Central Valley 26. I'm gonna be showing you guys, you know, some of my lifestyle, my brand, tone. Be sure to know. When I start dropping these merch and stuff like that, yeah, and use it, that you guys go download it. And uh, I will let you guys know probably who the actress was that I was talking about. Like, you know, I had a whole conversation. She was real cool, too. Hopefully, you know, maybe one day in the future, I'll run into her too again and maybe like do some real, real uh, actress work, stuff like that. But, uh, yeah. So, other than that, I think I'm gonna end this vlog and finish up this food because I'm trying to multitask, but at the same time, I'm really not multitasking. I feel like, because I'm really into this food right now. But, um, yeah. I'm gonna catch y'all guys on the next one. Stay up, you know, keep working hard, keep grinding. Mm. I'm gonna try to stop this somehow. So I'm actually not going to end the vlog right now. I'm actually going to go check out this car out. I had forgot because like I said, I was hungry. So I came in and ate. So I'm going to go check out this car real quick. Some of my uh, actual, you know, inspirations actually came from being around uh, that environment. You know, being around an actual set and seeing the cameras or seeing that they're, you know, I would say, you know, big actresses to me, uh, you know, doing their job actually inspired me, you know, to be an entertainer or go towards that uh, entertainment field, you know, from things that I had done as well, too. So, yeah, like I was saying, uh, I had looked up who the actress was because I couldn't remember her name, but I remember her face. So the actress actually happened to be Erica Ash. She had played on Real Husband as a Housewives on the Kevin Hart show. And uh, so, yeah, so that was the person I actually had got to, uh, you know, speak one on one and watch her, you know, work behind the scenes, which was actually pretty cool. All right, so yeah, I had to come check out this car real quick. So I'm gonna start it up, see if it starts. So everything's starting up so far. I do got some signs. I guess I gotta check out the battery and the engine check light just came on. I don't know why. This car just got an oil change, so I'm gonna see what's going on with this car. But other than that, it starts up, so hopefully it's nothing too too major. But it is starting up. So yeah, that's a good thing. Start. So like I said, I think that's going to be it for today's vlog. Um, I'll catch you all on the next one. And I'll probably see some more updates on this car, see what's going on. So yeah, I'll catch you all on the next one.